welcome students to yet another video on arithmetic progression and uh, this question has appeared in jee mains 2025 and uh, let's see what the question says a 2024 terms of an ap is given or we can say that ap consists of 2024 terms and we are required to find the sum of all the terms of the ap and the data given is a1 plus certain terms given within the parenthesis plus a2024 that sums or that adds up to double to double three so what formula we can use here so many of you would have known this or some of you may not have known those who already know recollect it and those who don't know learn it you can say sum of n terms is equal to n by 2 into ax plus ay Where a x and y are two terms of a p which are equidistant from the respective ends of the a p, and where x is the position of the term x, and y is a y is and y is the position of the term a y, and if you add x plus y, that should be equal to n plus one. If this condition is met, then you can very well use the formula s n is equal to n by two into a x plus a y. So in this problem, for an example, I will say, see a1 plus a2024. Obviously, they are the first and the last terms, though they are equidistant, and you can see the position. No, the a, uh, a1's position is number one, and a2024 position is the last. That is 2024. Therefore, 1 plus 2024 is equal to 2025, which is equal to n plus one. So, and therefore, it means we can group the terms which are equidistant. So for a5 plus a2020, you can see 5 plus 2020 is uh, 2025, which is n plus 1. Similarly, a10 and a2015, so on so on, up to a1010 plus a1015. Therefore, all the terms given within the parentheses can be grouped into terms which are equidistant from the respective end of the AP. So therefore, we can now try uh, the further part of the solution. Try to find out how many terms are there within the parentheses. For this, you can use uh, the usual formula L minus C by D plus one, where L is the last term, D, A is the first term, D is the common difference, and you add add one. And uh, we'll see uh, in this case it is two zero two zero minus five by five plus one, which is equal to four hundred four terms, which uh, gives us one divided by two, two hundred two such pairs which are equidistant from the respective position of the AP. So we are having uh, one more uh, pair that is A one plus A two zero two four. Therefore, we have two hundred and three pairs, which may add up to two to three three. Therefore, we can say the sum of any one of the pairs which are equidistant from of this AP is two to double three divided by two not three, which is equal to eleven. Therefore, we can say x plus y is equal to eleven, where x plus y is equal to n plus one. Therefore, we can use the formula now for finding out. Sum of uh, first 2024 terms, which is equal to n by 2 into a x plus a y. We know a x plus a y is equal to 11. N is 2024. Therefore, the required answer is 2024 by 12 by 2 into 11, which is equal to 1012 into 11, which is equal to 11132. So we have just finished this student, and this is an important formula. Many of you would have. Probably no, but you may not be knowing how to apply it or derive it. Rather, I can say n by 2 and a plus l itself has been derived from this only. Because see, a is the first term one, and l is the nth term, na. That is so one plus one, one plus n is equal to n plus one. So it's a obviously fantastic problem, and uh, it deceives us. But uh, try to practice more and more problems so that you can just go to the root of what has been asked. And you can definitely score at least 99 percentile and above for sure in JE mains, and of course in, um, you can do well in JE advanced as well. So practice well, students. Stay tuned. Please do subscribe to this channel. And good day.